Carl Douglas Doug McMillan is the president and chief executive officer of Walmart Stores, Inc. McMillan was promoted to succeed Mike Duke as president and chief executive officer of Walmart on November 25, 2013 and assumed the role on February 1, 2014. McMillan also sits on the Campania Euro Unregistered Trademark S Board of Directors. Early life, McMillan was born and grew up in Janesboro, Arkansas, the son of Morris and Laura McMillan. His father was a dentist who served in the Vietnam War. He received a bachelor's degree in accounting from the University of Arkansas in 1989 and an MBA from the University of Tulsa in 1991. Career In 1984, Macmillan began his career with Walmart as a summer associate in a distribution center. In 1990, while pursuing his MBA, he rejoined the company in a Tulsa, Oklahoma Walmart store. Much of Macmillan a Euro unregistered trademark s 22-year career has been in merchandising in the Walmart U.S. division, with experience in food, apparel and general merchandise. He has also held various merchandising positions at Sam's Club and Walmart International in addition to holding leadership roles in all three operating segments of the company. 1984 A Euro Summer Associate at a Walmart Distribution Center, 1990 A Euro began full-time career working at a Walmart in Tulsa, Oklahoma, 2006 A Euro 2009 A Euro President and CEO of Sam's Club, 2010 Euro 2013 Euro President and CEO of Walmart International, 2013 Euro CEO of Walmart. Sam Euro Unregistered Trademark S Club, from 2006 to 2009, Macmillan served as President and CEO of Sam Euro Unregistered Trademark S Club, an operating segment of Walmart, with sales of more than $46 billion annually during his tenure. Prior to heading Sama Euro Unregistered Trademark S Club, Macmillan held the role of Executive Vice President of Merchandising and Replenishment and helped drive the renewed focus on small business owners. Walmart International, from February 2009 to January 2014, Macmillan was the President and CEO of Walmart International, with more than 6,300 stores and more than 823,000 associates in 26 countries outside the U.S. During Macmillan a Euro unregistered trademark S tenure, Walmart International grew revenues by more than $50 billion and added nearly 3,000 stores. Macmillan oversaw acquisitions in markets such as China, the United Kingdom, Canada, Brazil, Central America and a majority stake in the Sub-Saharan Africa retailer Massmart Holdings Limited, which brought the company to Africa. Macmillan also worked to globalize a mortar Euro unregistered trademark SEDLP strategy and began to implement the strategy in some of a mortar Euro unregistered trademark S international markets. Memberships and associations Macmillan serves on the board of directors of the U.S. China Business Council, the executive committee and board of directors for Enactus, the board of directors for Walmart Mexico, and has been recognized as a young global leader by the World Economic Forum. Macmillan spoke at the Brookings Institution in November 2011 on the role of private companies in developing market-based solutions for addressing global challenges. Macmillan has talked about the impact and opportunities surrounding the global middle class in China, the importance of the changing role of women around the world and the Campania Euro unregistered trademark as new focus on e-commerce, mobile and social commerce. Macmillan participated in the 2012 Aspen Ideas Festival CEO series where he addressed how the private sector can partner with NGOs and government to address the challenges society is facing. He concluded by saying, A Euro OE we are not perfect, but we are a force for good, and things are better because we are here A Euro Macmillan was reported to have been a friend of the Walton family where in addition to his work for Walmart, he was on the Diana Euro Unregistered Trademark S Advisory Board for the Sam M. Walton College of Business at the University of Arkansas, as well as the Board of Directors of family-sponsored Crystal Bridges Museum of American Art. Politics Macmillan criticized the Arkansas bill allowing judicial scrutiny in cases that regard to religious belief, saying that it threatens to undermine the spirit of inclusion. Personal life Macmillan and his wife Shelley live in Bentonville. Arkansas and have two sons. References External links Appearances on C-SPAN